Outside Thomas. Passes it to Valentine. Here's Greenwood. Misses the three. Chicago leading by four. Outside Pippen. He pointer. And it's good. Assisting on the play was Jordan. Pippen's got 25 points. Scotty Pippen, a dependable shooter from here now. Like how he gets his feet set first. That's fundamental, but he's central. And here's Grant. He'll bring it up for the Chicago Bulls. They've led by as many as 11 points. A nice shot by Jordan. Jordan's got 33. He is certainly a dominant player. Michael Jordan, when he's in the zone, unstoppable. Pass to Aguirre. Here's Grant, and it's blocked. And that's out of bounds. Chicago will retain possession. And the Pistons making a change here. Dumars has checked in. There's 57 seconds left in the game. And really deep through that time. And it's a 12-point Bulls lead. What a game and moment for these guys. One they'll likely never forget. I mean, they've come away victorious. And the next stop is the NBA Finals for the Bulls. They did take higher percentage shots throughout, and Clark had paid off for them. Yeah, it sure did. I mean, I love the patience leading to that consistency shooting the ball. I mean, those things go hand in hand. Patience, good passing, and good shooting. And their place in the NBA Finals is secure with what will be a resounding victory for them here in Game 6. And one of the key components to this victory, if not the biggest, was the incredible performance for Michael Jordan. He was such a pest on the defensive end. Putting ball handlers on edge and disrupting the passing lanes, he forced plenty of turnovers. Pippen with the bucket. This run, it's a haymaker, a knockout punch. I think this run has sealed the game. Guys, where are we going to dinner? A three from McGuire. That one falls, coming off of Thomas's feet. wire has got 35 in the game. An immediate response to the last three-pointer. Aguirre showing you how dangerous he can be at the arc. And the Chicago Bulls will move on. They've got to be excited, but also a little relieved. So much pressure on this team from the media, the fans, and the players themselves. A tremendous opportunity now, just four wins away from a championship. They can see the finish line, but this last hurdle will probably be their greatest test. I'll tell you what, though, winning the Western Conference Championship is a big victory of its own. No matter how this season ends, it's been a successful one for them. And they'll represent the East in a final series that's mere days away. And so this one is in the books. We hope you've enjoyed being with us for the Eastern Conference Finals. For our reporter, David Aldridge, along with Clark Kelly.